Hey, Doug, how you doing? Hey, John, doing great. Doug Stanton from the National Writers Series uh, at Grand Traverse Pie Company, and you've been helping me eat a little pie here. <laughs> you know, we've, uh, we've pied it up. Uh, yeah. You've got a tough job. I, I do, but I, I, don't, I don't mind. It's part of the adventure that is Michigan's Best. Uh, speaking of Michigan's Best, you're, of course, one of Michigan's best known authors, and uh, you live here in the Traverse City area, and you have this National Writers Series, and a big event happening on Wednesday, November 15th, is that right? No, November, that was, that was no, yesterday. Yeah, it was yesterday. I that, lost my pie. It was opening of deer season. You <laughs> probably are still recovering. No, November 19th. November 19th. Wednesday, 7 p.m., Traverse City Opera House, downtown Traverse City, Michigan. It's the finale event for our fifth anniversary season for the National Writer Series with three very large authors who are going to come on stage and have an interesting conversation. Well, that's and that's what the National Writer Series is. Well, part of your mission, right? It's, it's to present this uh, series. Right. What we do on stage is uh, always it's pretty lively, it's pretty fun. It's not, it's not a Q&A, it's not a lecture, it's not school. Um, tonight, or uh, excuse me, on Thursday, and now you've got me. Yeah, yeah we're up with both. It's the pie talking. <laughs> on Wednesday, Benjamin Bush uh, from Michigan is going to be on stage as a host to Brian Turner and Brian Kastner. Uh, all three of them are acclaimed authors who happen also to have served in Iraq or Afghanistan. Right. George Packer, a staff writer for the New Yorker magazine, was here recently as an NWS guest. And George wrote a long piece on Turner, Kastner, and Bush, among others, yeah. citing them as really some of the great voices to come out of the past decade of strife and turmoil. And I want to say that, but also want to qualify it that if anyone knows Benjamin Bush, knows that he's a, uh, he's a uh, cross between Emmett Kelly and Christopher Walken. Wow. Now, he does a great Christopher Walken imitation, by the way, so you <laughs> want to ask him when you see him. Uh, yeah. But he's also uh, an actor. He had 16 episodes on the television show The Wire on HBO. Mm -hmm. He is an author of Dust to Dust, and he is a serious artist and, uh, and writer. So and he's he, from Reed City. And he now lives in Reed City. His wife uh, is a Russian professor at Ferris State University. Oh. So, at any rate, he brings to the, uh, to the stage these two friends of his to talk about really probably the most transformative moment in American history in the last decade, which is where we've been spending our tax dollars and we've been sending our young men and women. Sure. Um, ben tells me it's not going to be depressing. It's actually going to be, if you can believe it, fun and entertaining. Um, and knowing Ben, he'll make good on that promise. Well, the two authors that are going to be here with him? Brian Turner, mm -hmm. um, whose new book is just out called My Life as a Foreign Country. Yeah, right? Yeah, My Life. Yeah, let's, let's see the book cover. Sure. My Life as a Foreign Country okay. by Brian Turner. And then Brian Kastner has written a book called The Long Walk. Both of these are nonfiction, okay. they're memoirs. Um, and their literature. So they are both page turning and thought provoking. And finally, Ben's book is Dust to Dust uh, by Benjamin Bush. And all three will be on stage Wednesday, 7 p.m., November 19th, Charles City Opera House. <laughs> and uh, where can we get ticket information and come in more details? Uh, I would go to nationalwriterseries.org and click there. Hey, real quick, uh, I know you have a book uh, that you're working on. Last time we met, you told us. It's about Vietnam, and do you have a public publication date yet for that? I don't. Okay. But Soon. It, it won't. It will take me less time to write it than it did to fight that war. <laughs> I promise. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Doug. All right. Bye. Bye.